SMC, you said it's, it has a cap of three nanometer transistors. Yes. We cannot have smaller than that in TMC right now. But what's next? Like, what happens after two nanometer? We need more speed. Uh, so we cannot reach one nanometer transistor. The size, but I mean, the spacing between like atoms is like you know, uh, in like uh, 0.5 nanometers or something. <laughs> So you cannot really go like super small, uh, but um, at, at the same time, we're also doing technological innovations to keep the Moore's law going because Moore's law is increasing the number of transistors in a given area. So that can be achieved not just by reducing the size, but by doing, you know, some certain tricks. For example, initially, uh, there were like uh, two, uh, for example, if this is my transistor one, this is my transistor two. So, you know, this, uh, th this is like in a given area. So uh, this was planar. So now what if I just flip them? So now if I flip them, I can bring them closer. So I'm, incre I'm increasing the number of transistors in a given area because I've brought them closer and now I can have more transistors. So this is what like, you know, the mainstream technology currently is. These are called as finfets. Uh -huh. So now uh, again, like as we go ahead, uh, TSMC is planning to use gate all around type of transistors. So what does this mean? Uh, this mean? So basically you have transistors like this, right? So now what you will do is you will stack the transistors on top of each other like this uh, and it will go in vertical direction which is three dimensional. So now again like initially the transistor was here but now it's here so he has space for another transistor here. So basically you can pack more transistors and go in three dimensional structure. So in that sense we are trying to improve the number of transistors in a given area. 